greetings to you all in Christ and uh, have a blessed uh, day to you all, everyone. My name is Bernie, Brother Bernie Lumongsad, and I would like to share to you uh, the Word of God in Romans 10 verse 9. That if you confess with your mouth Jesus is Lord and believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you will be saved. Praise the Lord for, for his word. Um, I like this verse because it's so powerful and uh, if we really want to digest that, uh, first of we want to look that if you confess with your mouth, Jesus is Lord. So what I understood in this verse is that you don't need to mention anybody but the name of uh, the Lord Jesus Christ. Jesus is Lord. And the second part of this verse that really uh, struck me is the one that says, Believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead. Um, for me, it's so powerful because, uh, you know, I mean, this is like a mystery for just an ordinary person like you and me. But if it comes from God, this is basically a prescription that he mentioned to us. And, you know, uh, just follow, just follow him. And the third you know, part of this verse that says, and this is really a very powerful you know it says if you do the first one that if you confess with your mouth jesus is lord and the second one believe in your heart that god raised him from the dead you will be saved and for me that's the ultimate message in this uh, verse so uh like uh if you are in a situation right now where like you have tried everything, you know, and you know, everything and to no avail, you still have frustration, you still have uh, hopeless, uh, you know, the things in life. Why don't you uh, try Jesus? Because that's what being said here, you know, if you try Jesus, then coming from God that you will be saved that to me is believable knowing that he's the only God that I know who, who died but rose from the dead that's why we'll have this hope of eternal life in him in heaven so having said that I want to lead you into a prayer this is this should be a prayer that comes from your heart it not much about the words that uh, we say but it's the state of heart that we're in and God will honor it and the reason I'm saying this because as we know life is so short in this world and that uh, uh, death can come anytime so the question now is what will happen next and the Lord God promised us that uh, in a, in a lot of verses that we will be in heaven if we believe in him so along that line uh, I will lead you into this short prayer and uh, just follow me as long as it's from your heart so let's pray this prayer Lord God forgive me Lord for I have sinned and I want to repent of all my sin Lord, I believe that you died for my sin and that you, know, you rose again from the dead so that I have the, that hope of eternal life with you in heaven. Lord God, if I am at the point of my life that I want to establish that relationship with you as my Savior and Lord. And uh, that Lord God, this is coming from my heart and I want to ask you, Holy Spirit, to guide me every st step of the way as I start my spiritual journey with you. So, Lord, 
This is my prayer, and I ask this in Jesus' name. Amen.